Ahead of a tremendously busy travel weekend, pilots are on the picket line. Hundreds of Delta pilots are picketing outside Minneapolis St. Paul International Airport. This is not a strike, but a message to executives as contract negotiations continue. Our Kate Raditz is live at MSP International with the details. Kate. Sheila, I spoke with Captain Eric Hall. He has been a pilot for 25 years. He said that the pilots have not been making any progress in their contract talks with Delta Airlines. And he told me that they are concerned that the issues that travelers have been dealing with that we have been reporting on, he said they're concerned that they will continue to deal with those so long as the issues the pilots are dealing with and going through are not addressed by Delta. The picketing outside of Terminal 1 was one of many happening at Delta hubs all over the country. Pilots are informational picketing on their days off today. They are calling for four key points with the contract negotiations, better pay, retirement benefits, job security. But the biggest issue we kept hearing was the scheduling and quality of life. Hall said the problem with these cancellations right now is the airline is scheduling too many flights with current staffing. So it's time for management to recognize the contributions that the pilots have made to this operation and uh, taking time away from our families to get our customers safely and reliably to their destinations. So it's time for an industry leading contract. There are 14,000 Delta pilots. Uh, I did reach out to Delta Airlines to get their perspective, their side in regards to the contract negotiations. I have not yet heard back, but we do know that the airline did send an email out to customers today apologizing for these recent delays and cancellations. Shayla. Our Kate Raditz reporting. Thank you so much, Kate. While some people are flying this holiday weekend, millions more will be hitting the roads. AAA is expecting a record number of Americans will be getting behind the wheel. They're predicting 42 million people will take a road trip of 50 miles or longer. That means you could run into some congestion as you leave town. Travel experts recommend driving early or late in the day to avoid peak hours. 